and welcome back to my channel. It's time for another plan with Vivi. Today it's going to be more of a planner haul. I got some planner stuff in and I wanted to share it with you guys. <coughs> Excuse me. First thing that I got in was um or arm some pen gems. Everyone knows I love pen gems. They are amazing. I have lots of them. These are the ones that are in the signature collection that have the chrome or silver uh, tips. And then this is the autograph collection, which these pins have the gold. So I love them. They're my favorite. They are just sparkly wonderfulness. And I have to have them in every color, it seems like. <clears throat> Just because they're roughly about $9 to $10 a pen. The uh, gold ones, the autograph collection ones, and the designer pens are um, usually about $9 to $10, depending. Um, I'm sorry, the gold autograph ones are $10. The designer pen ones are anywhere between $9 to $10. Just depends on how it's done. And I absolutely love them. They're like the best pens ever. They write so smooth. The ink is so fluid. They are amazing. So I added some pens to my collection. One, which is the, in the autographs uh, collection, which is the blackjack one, which is, has the complete black barrel and the black crystals on it. Let's see if you can bring that up so you can see it. I love it so much and let me just show you they're just so cute I, I mean it's just I can't even begin so I got this one um, in blackjack and then this, <coughs> excuse me, I don't know why I'm coughing so much today. This one is a revamp pen. It is the Alaska pen, which was formerly known as the blue sapphire pen. And I have the blue sapphire pen, but blue is my favorite color. So it's like, I must have all the blue pens. So here you can see, this is the Alaska pen. And I'm going to put right next to it the blue sapphire pen. So as you can see, the barrel colors are different. This one's more of a solid one. This one has a lot of glitter. Let me bring that up to you so you can see. It has a lot of the shimmer in this pen. As far as the barrel is concerned. Whereas the new one, which is Alaska, does not. The crystals and this pen are deeper than these. So, of course, I had to get the new one because I must have all the blue pens. And, of course, she added a pen to the coffee shop collection, which, if you don't know what the coffee shop collection pens are, let me pull them out. This is the original coffee shop collection from pen gems. They're all in the gold autograph. And this one I bought when they originally came out. She came she re-released them again, which has everybody just like, "Yes, thank you for doing it." But this is the Macchiato pen, which did not come out uh, a la carte. It was just in the collection. And then we have the cappuccino, I mean, sorry, the chocolate pen, which is just gorgeous as well. And then, of course, the Latte Love pen, which pretty much is like the same barrel color as the cappuccino, as the chocolate pen. And it has the crystals, but in reverse that the macchiato pen has. 
which is gorgeous but she came out with a new one to this set when she relaunched it and it is the cappuccino pen and it is so cute and I love it and it's with the silver I don't know the silver chrome instead of the gold hardware I guess you should say that but those are my three new pin gems and I am so glad to be able to add these to my collection of pin gems the next thing that I got in the mail was some happy mail from SPC <coughs> now this is the first time I'm going to try out a monthly kit from hers but I saw this kit and I was like oh my gosh like I'm pretty sure I remember a couple spreads back in my, it was in January, that I did the same type of um, spread with a kit that I got from Planning World. And so when I saw this that came out in a monthly kit from SPC, one of my favorite shops, I just, of course, I had to get it. So let me show you to you. So we have this page of stickers here, which has the headers for the top of the month with some page flags and some long sticker strips here. Then we have Good Friday, Passover begins, Passover ends, and then this one that says Prance in the Rain, that's to cover the dates that aren't necessarily in the month of April. We have another one here that um, is also to cover up the boxes that aren't for the month of April with the little prancing horses. Then we have the sidebar sticker, which I'm thinking is going to be interesting because it is one whole sticker to put down. So that's probably going to be a bit of a challenge for me, but I'm up for it. Then we have the full deco boxes here, which are just amazing. I mean, it's the colors are gorgeous and it's got the faux glitter and it's unicorns. I mean, come on, who doesn't love that? Then you have this page here for your month for the bill dues you have your paydays your it has birthdays and all this other cute uh deco stickers here or for, to plan out basically your month and then you've got the april fools the earth day spc turns three years you have the easter sticker and you have a cute little shoshana sticker if people don't know that who shoshana is um andrea and nick have pugs and shoshana was the original one and i think she's got two more now but that's what that sticker is and then you've got the date covers some icon stickers and some cute little stickers here that say payday manny petty hair appointment movie night game night party date night bill dues birthdays cleaning days and some other random stickers as well so i am excited to get this kit <clears throat> and use it in my Erin Condren. I'm totes excited about this kit here. And I will shoot a plan with me for this month. And I know there's another kit, another April printable kit that I purchased from I think it's design sticker store that is so gorgeous and so cute more than likely I'm going to use that in my work planner which I never film my work planner but if the kit is so adorable I may just you may just get two monthly plan with me the next one um, is my SPC happy mail this is the March subscription kit and it is totally cute let me pull this out so of course you've got the freebie of post-it notes which I love them so much they match the kit we have our exclusive freebie here we have this cute little deco sheet of Instax cameras then we have glitter headers which are amazing we have our functional sheet our sidebar weekend stickers some mini icons as well as some three heart check boxes and checklist here with page flags we have habit trackers appointment boxes bill dues quarter boxes and half boxes we have the deco washi and headers page 
And then we have the plain washi with the littles. Um, ombre heart check boxes, which I absolutely love. Then we go down to this full deco boxes, which are so cute. But I think this is like meant to be like spring breaky, but I already got plans for my spring bake break page not that I go on spring break anymore but my niece does but um, this might be used I might hold on to this and use it for some time during the summer so then we have our date cutters and our bottom washi and then we have this sheet here with the girls just taking taking a break so that's that But yeah, I really think I'm going to be saving this kit for summer. Because it looks more summer to me anyway. Yep. So that is this kit here. Let's see if I can get this in here. And then moving on to... The next thing I got is some Planner Kate One stickers. And boy, did I pack on the Planner Kate One stickers. She did a birthday sale in her shop. So you got 36, was it 36% off? So I just, yeah, I totally went to town on it. I stocked up on. These are some freebies that came in with the kit with the, my order those are really cute they look more um personal planner size so that's probably where they're going to be headed but i stacked up on the remaining double dots and appointment boxes from june to the rest of the year because i bought i want to say last month i bought january through may of the double dots and the appointment boxes and so when I saw she was doing um, <clears throat> another happy birthday uh, sale I went ahead and stocked up so we've got the date double dots for June July August September October November and December and she just reformatted these so they were on sale for like 325 and then I got another 30 percent off so it was like yeah I'm gonna do it then we have the appointment boxes for June July August September October <clears throat> November and December now I know you probably I do use some planner Kate stickers in my plan with me is maybe not all my plan with me that I film, but I do use these stickers as I do have several other planners. I just don't necessarily film them all. I use them for different things. So if you don't see those, and sometimes I pull them into my Erin Condren, sometimes I don't, but they're like the best stickers and they're printed on removable matte paper, which makes them excellent. So you know me I have to have things straight so and then this I remember I told you guys about my this pen which is the pilot high tech C Miyaka pen that I got in a point three it is very very fine tip I love it for writing in my planner so if you remember oops, where am I at Let's see. Get it together. So if you remember this and how I did the little drawings and just the real skinny fine lines here, I did it with this pen. So I decided and I remember saying that I was going to probably get them in the color set, which I did. They didn't have a point three, they had a point four. Not that big of a difference for me. Um so I went ahead and got them and they are absolutely gorgeous. I love these pins so much that I'm just goofing off doodling here. 
but they are amazing and I absolutely love it. They are so cute and adorable and just they're so much fun to draw with and there's such like a fine line that I can draw in my planner kind of thing and so I'm really glad about this purchase I got these off of Amazon so that is that so this is all my stuff that I got all my happy mail I do have another order from SPC that just came in I know it's in my mailbox but I haven't got to go get it but I thought I'd share all of my planner finds with you guys so that's it for this video I hope you liked it if you did give it a thumbs up if not don't worry about it just keep on watching and to everybody in the planning world take care of you happy planning and bye